Hello, welcome back to Sarah Reacts. Today we're going to watch in season three, episode seven of Ted Lasso, and this one's called The Strings That Bind Us. So yeah, last episode was awesome. Our team were in Amsterdam, and originally it started with them all being pretty down because they lost the friendly match. But over the night, they became happier. They had little adventures, and it was just really lovely to see them being happy. <laughs> do you know what I mean? Especially Rebecca, who I do not blame her at all for swooning for that guy they are so precious together and I was so annoyed I didn't even realize until I was editing the full length reaction <laughs> that he didn't mean that they slept together he meant that you know they had a connection they fell in love all that stuff so my so my theory <laughs> after the reaction just ignore it, it doesn't make any sense now but whatever <laughs> I'm glad that Ted's kind of got his his back I can't figure the word <laughs> he's got some ideas for games and Beard seems happy with it so but yeah, enough chatting anyway, and uh, let's get into it. Oh, I saw your wire was running with. First edition or something? Yeah. And it's signed. No. <laughs> Keely, you go, girl. Jane Austen. <laughs> <laughs> Did you destroy a priceless artifact just to make you know? Oh, I'll go. <laughs> I'm me. still just grumpy because. You know, I don't know. Maybe in a few episodes I'll get over killing everybody's love. <laughs> you don't match. Samuel, if the food is good, which it is, no one cares about the suits. The coach dreamed up in a barbecue sauce related hallucination just last week. No, it's true, but hey, it's not about me. Go on, keep shouting. The best player on that team and the godfather of total football was this guy. Can anyone tell me who this is? It's Tim Robinson from I think it's should leave. No, it is Dutch football legend Johan Kraut. Pep. Look at that head of hair. Guy had to take away just to balance things out. Pep became a coach as well, honing his own version of total football. Where he briefly coached a uh, very talented young player. Until that beautiful dum dum quit to go do a reality show. That was wrong. It's about taking risks and supporting each other's choices. Like, when your friend wears something new and outside of his comfort zone, and instead of ignoring it, everybody pays him a compliment. Mm -hmm. oh, by the way, great hat ash. <laughs> we all know football is life. But a beautiful life. It's still football. <laughs> that was a great presentation. Give it up, that's coffee! Oh, we have a problem. The, oh no, wait, actually, no we don't. Sorry. Force of habit. Anything. Um, I'm just dropping this off. Thank you. Oh, that's, that's very lovely. Oh, may I? Yeah, of course, go. Sorry. Yes, Wonderkind. How can you tell if a girl likes you or it's just been nice to you? I can't believe he's changed his surname to Wonderkind. We wanted to apologise. What for? For getting all soft on you. Yeah. We humanised you. Oh, no. objectivity. Main reason why farmers don't name their livestock. And why we don't know the names of Spicy's brother's girlfriends anymore. Because they're male whore. Exactly. So we're going to backside a little bit. Now what the fuck are you doing to our team, wanker? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. no, no. <laughs> number three, awareness. And number four, well, I don't know what that one is yet, but I know it's important. Whistle on your feet, maggots! <laughs> Whistle. You sure you don't want a plastic whistle? That's what I said. <laughs> and congratulations, Jack and Keely. Love is love. No, that's not. <laughs> I think she might be love bombing you. She's a what? Love bombing. That's when you're bombarded with expensive gifts and trips and grand gestures of love oh, mm. well, the book oh, was too much okay. i don't know they do those they out there that name stuff or maybe we're love blind Ooh, love blind what's that it's an emotional version of color blindness mm. where a person interprets red flags as giant green just fucking go for it, flags <laughs> <laughs> did you come up with that yeah i did how, how do you tell if a girl likes you or just be nice to you you can't, you can't. But there is one surefire way to find out. You ask. Yeah. Ask her out. Yeah. No, no, I can't do that. It's between us on Friday night at 8pm, hopefully. On foot. 
Would you like to go on a date? <laughs> Stop waiting, Nikki. Yes, you could fail and be embarrassed for a second. But you could also get married, have two wonderful children, and live happily ever after. Actually, there's one thing I need to do first. Oh. I'm going to be Danny Rojas. Yeah, that's right, Isaac. And yeah. Danny is going to be you. Make sense? We're going to fucking walk, bro. I ain't do this, man. Well, <laughs> y'all don't need to do the voices. Oh. Oh. Okay, all right, y'all can do the voices. Yeah. 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 Which way are you going? I thought he was going to get hit by a car. Oh, it's a no, it's not going to get run over, is it? <laughs> Would you like to go on a date with me? Yes. Good. Good. I want to be happy for him, but I'm still like... Oh, no. Stung by his betrayal. Full of evil people who do shitty things, but I can't do with that right now because I have to go and kick a little ball around. What would those same people love me for? That is until I fuck up, or, or I miss a penalty, or, or I, I decide to fight back, and, and then you're just gonna want to ship me back wherever I fucking came from. Dad. <laughs> Just need to give it some time. Ask yourself, what does this situation need? I did the half <laughs> have a three goal lead and the Richmond have plenty to talk about. <laughs> okay. Well then. <laughs> All of our trends are so I ain't doing it wrong. You're doing it wrong. Whoa. 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 No, I mean, I mean, no, I mean, I think we're all doing it wrong. If we want this to work, you've got to stop going to me and start playing through me. You get me? Goodman over yeah. to Tart in the box. All Tart with the back heel. The box door is there to have you again. That was bloody gorgeous. A majestic, sweeping symphony of a goal. I've done this over three seasons. I have. Yes. By slowly but surely building a club-wide culture of trust and support through thousands of imperceptible moments, all leading to their inevitable conclusion. Total football. Well, how about that? Yeah. <laughs> it's gonna work. <laughs> He's so excited. Doesn't even matter what number four is. What a fucking dork. Yeah. <laughs> but he's our dork. Yo, 
Oh, look who's here. What does this situation need? We thought your situation needed us. <laughs> My father was Mr. Misanya. Call me Ola. Woo! My <laughs> Thostra! Oh, did he name after his dad? Oh, uh, don't worry. I'll order the new mirrors on Monday. No. No. Let's keep them. Season three, episode seven of Ted Lasso. That was such a good episode. Sam, Sam's dad has always been so supportive and kind to him. I just think, oh, compared to Jamie's horrible dad, it's nice to see. And oh, I don't know. With the Keely and Jack thing, I don't know whether I'm always suspicious in TV shows of new characters because I always think they're going to come in with some sort of ulterior motive and try and disrupt things and. I understand what the I understand their relationship is new and I want Keely to be happy but maybe it's my Keely Roy love and it's making me see the worst in her like Rebecca said. <laughs> but I don't know, Jack could be a really nice person and they could end up happily ever after. But what do I know? Hey, what do I know? But I liked it. I like that they're getting the total football thing and the they're scoring goals and I hope everything goes well. <sighs> because we've not got much episodes left. <laughs> but, I mean, with the Nate thing, I'm happy that his relationship's going well and kind of seeing him back to his normal self a bit because he, he didn't spit in the mirror. He seems to be get, getting normal confidence instead of the fake confidence. And But at the same time, his betrayal still irritates me. So I can't fully feel happy for him, if that makes sense. Yeah. So full and family access to the available on patreon.com or forward slash there reacts. I'll see you next time.